What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Apple Infinity CK Day. Gains! Before I start this video, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell, stay up to date with all my motherfucking videos. Follow me on Instagram and Apple Infinity and follow my band, Divided Dimension on Spotify. It should be in the description box below. If you guys want to see the channel grow, give the video a thumbs up. I really would appreciate it. it helps the channel grow, guys, and it doesn't cost you a fucking penny. If you guys want to donate to the channel or buy some Opperman Fitness or some Divided Dimension merch, that'll also be in the description box below. All that shit will be in the description box below. I got Storm Labs Zeus pre-workout action. Yeah, out of reviews action. You guys ready for this? Price point is $46 on their website for 30 servings. You're looking at a dollar and a half a serving. Not too bad, reasonable, right? Let's go ahead and get into the label action. Get into the label. So we have a Bolt Energy Blend made up of two amino isoheptane, 200 milligrams. You got that DMHA action. The real good stuff. Exotic stem, focus, all that shit. Caffeine coming in at 300 milligrams, straight up just caffeine. Then you have dicaffeinated malate, 100 milligrams, 400 milligrams total between the two caffeines. <clears throat> um, dicaffeinated malate, slow releasing, um, slow releasing caffeine. So then you have urogenesis at 175 milligrams, urogenesis, another exotic stem. Man, that's, that's fucking, that's fantastic. That's a fantastic blend for stim junkies. Synephrine, 30 milligrams. That's an upper dosage of synephrine. It's gonna uh, it's gonna help with nootropic action, focus, all around performance. Pump and a focus matrix blend. Uh, natural uh, L-citrulline, malate, eight grams, two to one, four grams citrulline. Not too bad for pumps. Pretty fucking good for pumps actually. Agmatine sulfate. Combined with citrulline, and a nice big help with for some pumps. One gram there. And then you have um, beta-alanine, carnosine, you know, the patented version, 3.2 grams. Remove lactic acid buildup, power output, performance, all that shit. Then you have some taurine action here, 1.5. Pretty upper dosage of taurine. It's going to help with pumps, hydration, shit like that. You have tyrosine, going to help with some focus action. One gram of that. Then you have Norvaline, 125 milligrams, going to help with uh, pumps and overall um, help push the ceiling of your um, your, your nitric oxide in your body. So it's going to help with pumps. You have Bioprene here, 25 milligrams. I have never fucking seen 25 milligrams ever in a pre-workout, ever. I've seen 5 grams and I've seen 10 grams, but not 25. I mean, not grams, 25 milligrams. I've never seen anything past 10 milligrams. And we'll get to that in a second. Then you have Yohimbine HCL. Don't worry, it's not alpha yo. It's just Yohimbine HCL, totally different. Four milligrams, pretty good dosage of that. It's gonna help with overall for performance and uh, really just get you in the zone and uh, combine all that shit together. And that's what you got. This is you got some Zeus action. By the way, Bioprene, 25 milligrams. So as soon as you open this up, like you can just sit here and sniff a little bit. And that pepper just fucking just, holy shit, pepper, right? Now, I've talked about this before in the past with pre-workouts. And um, I've seen 10 milligrams and it literally just tastes like straight pepper. Like it's burning my mouth and shit. I don't know how they did it. <clears throat> but this motherfucker actually doesn't taste bad at all. Like it tastes like, by the way, the, the, the flavor is sour green apple. Sour green apple is pretty decent. It's like a standard sour, it's like a standard green apple. It's not really sour, but it's a standard green apple that you would think. Pretty similar to like a Jolly Rancher green apple, but more of like a, maybe like an off brand type of taste. Um, it's a good flavor. I'm gonna give the flavor like, I'm gonna give the flavor like an eight. I'm gonna give it an eight out of 10 for flavor. But it does have just a little bit of pepper taste, just a little bit, and it's not even that bad. Like. There's plenty of pre-workouts where I've had where the bioprint is just super strong and it burns your lips. I don't know how they did it, but this dosage is insane. 25 milligrams. And it you can't even taste it. Like it's barely noticeable. I couldn't believe it. <clears throat> when I seen that, I'm like, holy shit, that's a lot of fucking black pepper. Alright, so anyways, flavor, I'm gonna give it an eight out of ten. I actually liked it. It's pretty much like a knockoff Jolly Rancher green apple. Pretty solid. So let's get into the effects. <clears throat> Let's get the effects. Energy, fucking fantastic. Energy is on fucking point. Um, you know, they got the tuna amino in there and you have the arira. That fucking combined with all the other shit, this is a fucking stim junkie pre-workout. Like, it's nothing over the top, 
but it will satisfy a stem junkie pre-workout. It it will stat it will satisfy a stem junkie. This is a fucking solid pre-workout for goddamn sure. Um, you know the 3.2 beta. I don't. I didn't feel like it was 3.2 for some reason. Like usually 3.2 comes in really really hot, very fucking tingly, very like everywhere. Um, it comes in, but it doesn't come in as hot as you would think. Um, for the pumps, I think they're mediocre at best. To be honest, I didn't really, you know, I don't really don't like look at pumps that much as, as far as like for pre-workouts anyways. There's obviously some stuff in here that's good for pumps. And I, I think pumps, you know, mediocre at best. Um, but the energy and the focus is on fucking point. The pumps were just, you know, in the middle range. I don't think they were disappointing, but I don't think they were not existent. They were definitely there, but it wasn't like a, you know, a fucking highlight of this pre-workout at all. Um... As far as mood support, you know, you look at here, there's really not much mood support. I wasn't like happy, fucking crazy happy type of deal. This isn't that happy type of pre-workout. This is more of like tunnel vision-ish. But, I mean, there's not much tunnel vision shit in here either. But it's more of like a, uh, it's more of like great energy, clean energy. You're focused. Um, mood support is... You don't feel you don't feel you don't feel uh, happy, but you don't feel mad, and I don't think you have that rage. But the sense of urgency is there for sure. So you got the sense of urgency, but it's not like a ragey, like you're pissed off type of pre workout. Um, so the sense of urgency is there. Pumps mediocre, like I said. Um, so yeah, I mean, I think it hits three out of the four. I think it hits three out of the four categories really for pre workout. Pumps is in the middle range. You got focus, energy. And uh, what's the other one? Focus, energy, and uh, mood support. I'd say focus and energy's here. Mood's about right here. And pumps are about right here. And then, yeah. So two out of four. Two out of the four hit really well. The mood support, like I said, if you're in a good mood, it's not going to ruin your good mood. If you're in a bad mood, it's not going to make you happy. Like I said, there's not anything that's going to make you happy as far as the mood support is concerned. Um, but I think that this is very comparable. I was thinking about this when I took this. I was trying to compare it to something else. This is very comparable <clears throat> to Omega Sanction. They're very similar to me. They're very similar to me. And by that, I mean they're just really good um, stim junkie pre-workouts. And uh, I think that they knocked it out of the park. They definitely knocked it out of the park. So if you guys want to check this out or Omega Sanction, you guys will not be disappointed if you try either one of these or if you try them both. Let me know what the fuck you think as far as what's the difference. But it's a good, it's a good pre-workout. It really is. Um, I think they they really hit every avenue here. Um, <clears throat> and uh, yeah, so check it out. Let me know what you guys you think. Uh, I want to thank Storm Labs for sending me this over and giving me the opportunity to review it on my channel. Thank you very much. And other than that, guys, that's gonna be pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for the support as always. Let me know what you want to see next. And if you don't like too fucking bad, subscribe, share, like, and comment below. Scrub it on troll. And only because I'm fucking swole. Don't forget to follow me on my social media, Armin Fitness, Facebook, Armin Fitness, Snapchat, Armin Fitness, Instagram, Armin Fitness. Don't forget to like my band page, Divide Dimension on Facebook. Follow my band, Divide Dimension on Spotify. And shop all of your stuff at tigerfitness.com using my affiliate link, which will be in the description box below. And if you guys want to check this shit out, go to Storm Labs. Zeus is the uh, pre workout. Sour green apple is the flavor that I reviewed. They do have a couple other flavors. I really don't know the other flavors, but this is the one that they sent me. And, uh, <clears throat> yeah. Oh, I forgot to talk about power output and endurance. I was in that fucking gym for literally, like, hour and a half every time, no matter what. Like, it, it, it lets you keep going and going if you want to keep going. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> so, overall, fucking damn good pre-workout. Another than that, guys, that's pretty much it. And I'll check you guys later. Oh.